Typical, you get the camera out and it goes quiet. Wait for it. Wait for it. Come on. Yeah, so anyway, as it's gone really quiet, we are here at Brands Hash. Hello! There we Can't go. Can't tell already today. We're at. Uh, we're at Brands Hatch for the Blog Pan series. It's qualifying day today. And just as you want a car, one doesn't count. I oh, know, just as you want a car, <laughs> one doesn't turn up. Um, oh, it's a bird as well. Oh, the noise. All right, we've got qualifying for the Blog Pan today. I think we've got a couple of races later yeah. in the Porsches. Yes. And then we've got European GT4 Championship as well, um, which is also to. They qualify today, but they race tomorrow. Right. We've not seen those out on track yet. Obviously, the Blancpain cars were out at the moment. And we've seen the basic Porsche Challenge. Porsches, yeah. Some really nice liveries in that one. Um, so, yeah, we'll show you some more cars today, I think. And um, There might be a few. There might be a few. And also, the Supercar Siege is supposed to be happening. So, uh, we will try and find some of those for you as well. So this is now out around the back of the circuit. They've done a bit of improvements. Um, as far as safety goes, they've done some improvements. Um, as far as taking photos goes, they've kind of ruined the back of the track. We used to be able to get some really good photos around um, Stirlings. Um, but they've made this nice little woodland walk, which is really lovely. Not what we're here for though, but still, <laughs> every cloud and all that. But uh, yeah, we used to be able to get over to the barrier over there and take decent photos, which is just not going to happen now. It's a bit of a shame. Try and find somewhere else. Yes, we did a little bit of update on what's going on in the back of the truck, actually. Um, we just stopped and chatted to a nice bloke who seems to know what he's talking about. Apparently, they um, they couldn't get their insurance to the back of the circuit again without proper catch fencing up. So um, that's what they're doing, and uh, they've cordoned this off for the for the moment until they can get the catch fencing up in time. Uh, which is actually what you said earlier, so fingers crossed we can get go back to uh, Stirlings uh, in the near future anyway. But in the meantime, this is actually pretty nice to be fair. The country that, walk. Country walk. They've actually put some bark chippings down now so you don't sink in the mud anymore, which is, uh, which is all right. Oh, I think that was a Bentley. <laughs> I think we found a little bit of Martin. Lovely M4. Well, you can't decide between that and the GTR. And that's our next video. Help me decide what I can't afford. 
Yeah. <laughs> that should be a thumbnail. GTR or M4? Seriously though, look at it. It looks like it murdered you in your sleep. <laughs> anything from the VW group or even the BMW group because they do a similar colour. Why? 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 Further to Craig's comment a moment ago. Why Ford? Why? What were you thinking? I'm sorry if this is your car but what were you thinking? Oh hello. This podcast was brought to you from the Polmate Studio in front of a live studio audience. Um, for anyone that doesn't know, which is probably everyone, uh, we call ourselves the Squirrel Army because there was a video a little while ago with Chris Mees, I believe it was on Instagram, um, and it turns out Germans have a problem pronouncing the word squirrel, in fact pronouncing it squirrel. So uh, if you see out at Druids uh, the, the races today at 12 and at two, two, half four, half four, I believe, um, there is a banner up there with a squirrel driving an Audi R8. And that's dedicated to Chris Mees, who's Gemma's favourite driver in, in this race series. So if you see lots of referrals to squirrels and things like that, that's basically what that's all about. Anyway, good morning. We're here. It's Sunday. Uh, it's race day at last. It's a supercar siege day. So we're going to get lots and lots of pictures of some supercars today. I believe there's a couple of Koenigseggs turning up, which I'm really excited to see because you tend to see Ferraris, Lamborghinis, McLarens all over the place. Not so many Koenig's eggs, so that would be good. Um, unfortunately, my partner in crime is uh, not feeling himself today, so I don't know how much footage we're going to get. We'll do what we can. I don't think he's going to be on camera very much. I think he's feeling a little bit quiet, to be honest. So uh, we'll, we'll give him an easy day. We'll, we'll let him have a day off today because it's very rare. But I think we're going to go out and get some breakfast. I think there's going to be some layers coming off because it's turning into the most beautiful day going, hence why I'm in the shade here. And uh, I'll catch you later. Thank you very much.
Are you sitting on it? Yeah, she has that problem with me. <laughs> <laughs> That's where all the proper work's done.